It's April 2nd, 2020. Title, Ode to a Hug, Chopped and Screwed, dot mp3. Chest, press, spine, curl, 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 palm, palm, prints, neck, neck, neck. Neck, nuzzle. Oh, what I would forfeit to crease into your collage, hair and bath soap sheath and brilliant bone your wings. How they've crinkled to cradle my torso. Praise be to this. Ceremony, ancient choreography, vertical cuddle, portable fireplace, we melt into maroon, chin deep, thumps calibrate, chopped and screwed, your breath a swatch of fleece, what happens to a body unhugged, skin unwoven. Oh, how I long to rest in the whiff, in the whiff, in the whist of you. It's April 4th, 2020. Title, NYC death toll tops 1,500 as Kuwama warns on ventilators. Can we talk about elbow pasta sex appeal? Birds keep tapping on my window, flaunting and shit. Today feels like Thursday. Eating Tuesday's taco, smearing Saturday's liquid mat. I don't know why my hair insists on growing, but I went online to order clippers and a clit sucking vibrator was on sale. It's always let's video chat and never let's kill your landlord. Octavia told us in the 90s, but I lost my library card. I want to write a rom-com where everybody is just outside Touching. I play this game where I guess what kind of porn my eyebrow threading lady watches. I know this is the end because my mom said my ex-girlfriend's name out loud. I want my roommates to go home, but they already are. I'm pretty sure my knees are shrinking. If my room were a coffin, I'd give it three out of five stars i want a refund for all my bras and panties can you get a gift card for therapy everything's canceled and my period won't take a fucking hint people keep dying so i should probably make a tiktok i showered 72 episodes ago i'm fine my neighbor swear reggae is the remedy once i'm out of weed maybe i'll roll up all my socks i've listened to this album more times than i've cried <laughs> even my lamp is lying carranza says we're building the plane while flying it all my friends are soaring in love but i'd rather envy the water stain on my ceiling gainfully employed just brewing up there, brown and blithe, tipsy off its origin, spreading its rings on poached thyme, too busy being American to fear collapse. It's April 14th, 2020. Title to the next person I fall in love with. Know that I've envisioned spending an apocalypse with you. I don't know what you did to get sweeter than my solitude, but I hiked through hills of hurt to get here. Right now, with you in this improbable orbit, 
There was a time I couldn't fathom my heart doing this again. Loss said everything must go. And it did. The sky was falling and I made peace with my loneliness. Gave each kind a pet name after an obscure color. Built a shrine of platonic love and kissed it every night. Know that even when I quit, I was practicing. Even when the country was a shadow of crumbs, I wrote you a poem. It's April 15, 2020. Title, The Stimulus Checks Dropped Today. I chase my crumbs with a fork as gratitude and outrage fist fight in my stomach. I think of my father, how he's never greeted a raise with a smile. I'll never let them white folks think I'm satisfied. They always got more than they given and I'm always worth more than what they got. I stare at my account, this dreadful ritual bow to my cyber emperor my whole life shaped by paper rectangles optical illusions 2.61 inches wide and 6.14 inches long dirty diversions 25 percent linen 75 percent cotton have I ever not been captive? My debts don't even make this hush money mine. I don't know how to escape this fiscal violence. Where do you report nationwide abuse? Wake me when it's people over profit. I must rest now. I spent the afternoon stuffing my face with sweets, pouring sugar into wounds cut like open wallets. It's April 25th, 2020. Title, Re. No apologies for my delayed response. I've been busy compiling reasons to stay alive. I can assure you, your email is not finding me well. You can keep your translucent pleasantries. I nearly choked on my cranberry juice while reading your audacious ask. Per our pandemic, I don't have any deliverables, updates, ideas, calendar invites to virtual meetings will be declined. Just so I'm clear, you need me to forget the government is trying to kill me and everyone who can't buy a mask without checking their bank account. According to my records, this isn't the first time you've prioritized productivity over humanity. I'm writing to inform you that you're an accomplice in this genocide. I'm not interested in helping sustain any machine that helped manufacture this cataclysm. Moving forward, my inbox is open only for direct deposit confirmations. For your convenience, I've attached a headshot of the marionette you've mistaken me for. Please excuse my tolerance for smelling like approval, my participation for walking like pride. I'm not looking forward to hearing back soon. Coldly, disrespectfully. No regards.